Cancer treatments have come a very long way in the past several years, and a new one called biomarker testing has actually been able to increase people's chances of beating cancer. Now, here in Georgia, the testing not always standard practice because it's not covered by most insurance companies, and it's expensive. Atlanta News first reporter Abby Kasura is joining us live tonight from the state capitol with what's happening to help change that. Abby? Yes, and I have that bill right here, House Bill 85. It doesn't have a name, but it does have a purpose, expanding access to a life-saving tool that can help pinpoint for doctors what kind of treatments cancer patients may need, giving them precious time. Pneumonia that I kind of let run a little bit too long um, and come out with a, a stage four lung cancer diagnosis was it, it threw everything into like a 180 tailspin. Jamie Knox is a cancer patient turned biomarker testing advocate. The test uses blood and tissue to identify the best type of treatment for a patient, whether that's chemo, radiation or pills. It's proven to help patients live longer. As the patient, the, the load should not be on us to ask for biomarker testing or to know that it's something that we need to have done. The doctor should just automatically go ahead and do that. For Jamie, the testing was covered by her insurance. More than half of the insurance companies in Georgia don't cover biomarker testing, which falls below national clinical guidelines. That's like you know, going to a restaurant and asking for your food and they bring it to you in your hand instead of putting it on a plate. And then they, when you ask them why they're giving it to you in your hand, you say, oh, you didn't ask for a plate. I don't know that. Why would I need to ask you for a plate? It should be standard. Groups like the American Cancer Society in Georgia are pushing for House Bill 85, which would require health insurance companies to cover biomarker testing if there's any evidence it could help the patient. The cost is minimal. It would raise premiums 50 cents a month. Who wouldn't pay an additional 50 cents if you could have back somebody that you love who died from cancer? If I could have my daddy or my best friend back for an additional 50 cents a month, Biomarker testing means Jamie can continue working, staying active, and enjoying time as a newlywed. Four states have already passed similar legislation. A dozen more are considering it, including here in Georgia. Now the bill's sponsor, Sharon Cooper, is the head of the health committee. Live in Atlanta tonight, Abby Casoris, Atlanta News First.